Rebecca Faith. Throughout my life, I always wanted to find true love. For a long time, I felt I was searching so hard that it may not be in the cards for me. And part of me felt that I would have to change who I was slightly to be the person someone else needed or wanted. That was the toughest part, because I didn't want to change. Over time, I thought I might give up on it. But then suddenly, when you became my roommate, all of that changed. I was so nervous about making a move when we were just roommates and looking back, I don't know how I waited so long. But whatever the reason was, you were worth waiting for. I realized true love didn't mean I had to change myself. It was about finding the person that accepts me for being me. The person that is my best friend and I can't picture life without. You are the definition of what true love is. You've been like the biggest cheerleader for me in my life and I'm just so incredibly happy to be standing here today and cheering you on as you marry the love of your life today and Tim I just I truly can't think of a better match for Becca. Our story is one that I never could have dreamed of. I may be biased, but it's the best love story I've ever heard. You always had this calming presence that made me feel immediately comfortable, so easy to confide in, and truly just felt like home. You know how I'm feeling before I even do, and you always know the right things to say or do to make me feel better. <laughs> the drive that you have is so attractive to me, <laughs> and I know that you'll never lose that. I have no doubt that you will always put in the effort to make our marriage and family a success. I could go on forever listing all of the things I love about you, and I still could never come close to describing the way I feel about you. Welcome and thank you for being here on this glorious day. We have been invited here today to celebrate the uniting in marriage of Rebecca Thompson and Timothy Kuntz. Tim, you are a friend I never wanted to lose. You have the most kind and giving soul and that's why so many people are drawn to you. You are so genuine and intentional with all the people in your life.
of faith. You are without a doubt the best thing that has ever happened to me. Everything I have ever truly wanted and what makes my entire world. I am the luckiest man to be bearing not just the girl of my dreams, but my best friend. first step of their new beginning, their new life together. The ability and desire for one human being to love another is perhaps the most precious and fulfilling gift that has been entrusted into us. It is an all-encompassing task, a lifelong endeavor, the journey you've been preparing for your entire lives. Love is patient and kind. Love does not boast or envy. It is not arrogant or rude. It does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice at wrongdoing, but rejoices at the truth. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things, and love never ends. These blends will then complete the mix that after a year of aging in the barrel will be enjoyed on their first wedding anniversary. Tim, before your family and friends, do you take Becca as your beloved wife to have and to hold through laughter and in sadness, through challenge and success, as long as you both shall live? I do. Becca, before your family and friends, do you take Tim as your beloved husband to have and to hold through laughter and in sadness, through challenges and success, so as long as you both shall live? I do. Rebecca Faith, I promise to always be your best friend, to be an outstanding husband that you deserve to always support you and your dreams. I promise to laugh with you in joy, grieve with you in sorrow, and grow with you in love. And I promise to always love you now and forever. I can't wait for everything the future holds, the ups and downs, the adventures, the lazy Sundays on the couch, and everything in between. Love you, Snake. Tim, I vow to always listen to you and communicate with honesty and truth. I vow to be the support that you need in any situation that you may need it in. I vow to always be your partner, lover, teammate, and best friend for the rest of my life. I can't wait to spend forever with you, and I love you with all, all my heart, always. in me, I pronounce you, Tim and Becca, as husband and wife, lawfully wedded before God. Tim, you may kiss your bride. was worried about Hart moving out of their apartment in Frederick, Maryland. At the time, I just knew Becca was commuting from Maryland to Pennsylvania for work. And yeah, Becca will move in with him. Yeah, all right. <laughs> like, it was mutually beneficial for both of them, and I was like, I was just laughing about the idea, but I told Tim. And a couple weeks later, surprisingly, she agreed to move in. <laughs> a while later, though, Tim called me and he told me he didn't know what to do. 
He told me that he was falling for Becca and excitedly started listing off all the qualities he loved about her. I just told him I felt he should do what was felt right. And a week later, he told me that they were a thing and he was so happy. And I still hear that happiness today. happy or proud to be here today and celebrate you guys. Everybody would just raise your glass to the couple of the decade, yeah. Becca and Tim. Tim has a unique gift of being able to bring people of all walks of life together. All of us here have a different story with how they met Tim, and somehow he has the ability to balance all of us in his life. Today is the day we celebrate not only all of our stories that brought us here today, but most importantly, your story together. So everyone, please join me in the toast as a new chapter of their story opens today, a chapter of love and happiness. Yeah.